How's it going guys? With the latest things happening at the simulator, it's quite important to get a good idea on what's coming from Aerosoft. Before we begin, welcome to the channel and subscribe for important updates on flight simming, patches, releases, anything at all that's related to flight simming, you've come to the right place. So what's going on at Aerosoft? Apart from the finest airports that develop, with two more airports in the making, Aerosoft is not just focusing on the CRJ release, but something more. We all know this amazing developer, Aerosoft. A premium partner to the simulator have been in the works for their Airbus models and most definitely Airbus is one common area where we all are curious to see if we are expecting more than the current model what we have in the default lot of the planes in the simulator. The developers at Aerosoft have a few of them currently in development for Microsoft Flight Simulator of course. The interesting part about this is that this is not just a port model where we expect to see a model that's been completely taken off from a previous platform and have been implemented. It's rather a different approach where a brand new build with lots of fabulous features trying to adhere to the standards of requirement from Osobo are being developed. The manner they want to release this is to first take care of the CRG series, the 500 and the 700 followed by the 900 and the CRJ1000 and finally go to the Airbus slot. At the moment, there are a few resources who have dedicated towards the design aspect of this model and Aerosoft expects this team to grow in order to fulfill not just the current requirement but to also see what else they can think of developing under their brand. They plan on taking care of all the details in their upcoming models right away from the highest level of details all the way to minute details that include a good functioning cockpit. This is in the current build they are right now working on as modeling and texturing have already begun progressing. They're right now focusing on the core aspect of how the system works in order to see that the behaviors and the performance can be well synchronized towards the simulator. The models specifically under Airbus that are being planned would be the A320, A321, 318, the A319 and the A330. Quite interesting models and hopefully we should see them appear soon during this year. One thing to note is that while the CRJ series are in current development, it's good to know Aerosoft is taking its own pace to see that no blunders can take place after the launch. This can demonstrate good quality as they've always focused on not just quality products but also development along with good craftsmanship in models. It's certainly fun to fly those long hauler planes and while we do have the FSX version of the A321, it's nice to expect a good modeled and programmed version of it in the coming weeks. We're surely going to see a lot more updates from Aerosoft so go ahead and subscribe for further updates on this and other areas of flight simming. Hope you like this video guys, thank you for watching and stay tuned.